Hello dear students, after the motivational theories, uh, the second topic is the personality regarding the unit number 2 in OB subject. So let's start it, what is the meaning of personality and how its um, effect and impact on the organizational behavior. So let's start. First of all, uh, personality and value. So what is the meaning of personality? Then what are the characteristics of personality? Then what are the types of personality? Then what are the factors is influencing on the personality? Then the theory of personality. So in this topic regarding the personality, you should learn about this. Okay, and in this video lecture session, I discuss about this the meaning of personality. Then what are the characteristics and features of personality? And what are the types of personality? And what type of factors there are the influencing on the personality? And what are the theories considered regarding the personality? Okay. So let's start. First of all, what is the introduction of personality? So personality is the unique characteristics of human resources. Okay. So different person have a different type of personality. personality Simple छे अथवा तो दरेक लोगों बराबर छे तो ये दरेक लोगों ने personality जेचे different person have the different type of ideas, thinkings, attitudes and according to their behavior and perception their personality is also differ. Okay, so this definition of personality means what? The personality is the dynamic organization within the individual of the those. There are the psychological system that the derives is a unique adjustment to his environment. This definition is given by Jordan Alport. Okay. Okay. Today's definition is Jordan Alport. We have seen that what is it? That personality is such a dynamic behavior. That our all over behavior, which is within individual, that we see, think, or so, is our face, upper, our attitude, ma, our behavior, ma, have it. So, we have personality. Kahiye chye. Personality is include the external appearance and the behavior and the inner uh, inner aware uh, awareness of the self as the is the permanent organization of the force and the particular pattern or the organization of the measurable threats both inner and outer. This de uh, definition is given by the float at rush. Okay, personality is not external behavior. But you have physical appearance, chhe, tamara, uh, ke ke choosing of your clothes selection, um, chhe, your height, okay, your physical appearance, your gestures, your posture is not considered as your uh, only personality, right? Your inner awareness. Ke tamaru um, atma vishwas su chhe, tamara pota na internal kaya guno chhe, kai qualities chhe, toh e badhu chhe chhe e personality ma consider karwa ma ave chhe. Then after, what are the characteristics of personality? Personality is the pattern of the stable behavior that leads the goal of achievement. Okay, personality is what is stable behavior. What is the organization goal and your self, your goals achieve your goals? Such stable behavior state is to be protected by the individual through the some unique way. So it consists as the enduring. Barabar chhe ke tamaru je stable behavior chhe, it protect kare chhe tamne ke tamhe koi pan unique way thi, koi situation ne kewi dite solution lavo chho. So it tamara personality upar depend chhe ke different person have a different type of personality and according to that personality they should take the decision. Te loko pota no decision le chhe. अने डिसीजन जे छे एमनी पर्सनालिटी ने डायरेक्ट अफेक्ट करे छे के जो पर्सन जे छे एनी पर्सनालिटी बहु एक्सट्रोवर्ट छे के इंट्रोवर्ट छे अकॉर्डिंग टू देट हैव टू डिसाइड ओके देयर वे देयर यूनिक वे देन द पर्सनालिटी इज रिफ्लेक्ट द इंडिविजुअल डिफरेंसेस एंड द पर्सनालिटी इज ऑलवेज यूनिक एंड दस द पर्सनालिटी इज डिफर फ्रॉम पर्सन टू पर्सन के बदाज लोगों ने पर्सनालिटी जे छे डिफरेंट होय छे अने डिफरेंट पर्सन हैव द डिफरेंट टाइप ऑफ पर्सनालिटी के अलग-अलग लोगो प्रमाणे एनी पर्सनालिटी पण अलग-अलग होय छे एज नोटेड अर्लियर पर्सनालिटी इज कंसीडर एंड द एंड्यूरिंग सो स्टिल इट मे बी चेंज अंडर द सर्टेन थ्रस्ट ऑफ इवेंट के आपरे जे हमणा डिस्कस करियो ए प्रमाणे के पर्सनालिटी जे डिफर होय छे तो डिफरेंट सिचुएशन छे तो एमा पर्सनालिटी पण छे ई चेंज थती होय छे then what are the types of personality? So there are mainly five types of personality. Uh, neurotrichism, 
extrovert extroversion openness agreeableness and the consciousness okay so first one there are the neurotism means what neurotism means ke koi person che is person have a personality to consider their inner feelings and they cannot we can say very extrovert they cannot share their ideas their knowledge to the other person so it called as a neurotism ke je person che they are very thinky they have to think and then and then they have to decide ke koi person che ini personality evi che ke pote decide kare che pote thinking kare che ane koi person sathe e directly share kari shaktu nathi to ene neurotism personality kevai che then after extroversion is is the opposite from the neurotism ke a opposite che neurotism ke a je prakar na je personality je person ne hoy che to te je che openly openness je che koi pan idea che koi pan koi pan vat che koi pan problem che to e easily bija loko sathe share kari shake che so is called the extrovertness then openness is also considered is a one type of we can say extrovertness and in openness they can free they cannot have a take a any thought in the extroverts they have to take some thoughts and then after they have to reveal their information but in openness they cannot uh, think little bit and they have to share their information to the other persons right so it's a open minded person then agreeableness agreeableness is a personality is considered the person who should agree with the other person's point of view and they cannot uh, take the we can say any action uh, from the other person's point of view and they cannot we can say intimate the anything right ke koi person che ani koi vat che to he easily agree thai jai che so is called as a agreeable personality then after consistentious personality is consistentious personality is considered as a person Uh, who are working uh, very stably and they cannot share their information with the other person and they have to be a we can say uh, they have to be a both type of personality there are some extrovert and some introvert personality so they are called as a consistentious personality okay then after what are the factors that's in influencing on the personality so first one there are the biological factor first one there are the physical features our physical features is one type of we can say our image to create image on the other minds ke aapru je physical features je che e bija na mind upar tarat j affect kare che so e ek type ni personality ma tame consider e je factor je che affect kare che then after heredity heredity means what there are the we can say consider that uh, there are the some genes and some dnas are converted uh, we can say they have to be a passed through one generation to another generation uh, and sometime according to heredity some type of person have to take the personality koi person je che emna emna grandfather forefathers ma koi evi skill che koi knowledge che koi evi personality che koi evi kevai ke koi evi unknown skill je che तो ये आए थे हेरिडिटी में तो एवं रीते हेरिडिटी थ्रू पर पर्सनालिटी क्रिएट थाय देन आफ्टर ब्रेन आप ब्रेन जकोर्डिंग टू देट योर पर्सनालिटी क्रिएट कि जेपर थिंकिंग थॉट्स ब्रेनना ये पर्सनालिटी में इफेक्ट करे बराबर है देन आफ्टर फेमिली एंड सोशियल फेक्टर समटाइम्स फेमिली बेकग्राउंड इज ऑल्सो कंसिडर फॉर फॉर योर personality according to your family background uh, sometimes you have to thought according to that okay then after social factors are considered regarding the society so according to the societal behavior you should consider the, your personality then after situational factor according to situation your personality should be different okay so if the situation is favorable then your uh, personality is different and if the situation is unfavorable then your personality is different right then interests and motives if a person have to interested in a particular sector then there should be work with the we can say very efficiently and if there are the not uh, motives any person so uh, their personality is to be a differ then culture and character uh, as we know that our india has to cons- consider the various types of we can say peoples and various type of people have the different type of cultures religions rules okay so according to their culture they have to shoot their personality okay then after theories of the personality so there are the mainly four theories of the personality in your examination uh, if they have to ask the write the theories of personality then you should write this four of uh, four of this and if they have to ask uh, we can say only individual theory then you should write according to that only 
first one there are the Pedrian theory then after uh, then after second one is a uh, second uh, second point is to be a consider first one is a Faradian theory second one is the uh, Jungian theory then after neo freudian theory and the trade theory okay so first one there are the freudian theory so freudian theory is to be a consider as the the theory is developed by the sigmund freud so the eminion of the world is renowned from the psychologist is a uh, sigmund food is a one type of psychologist and who are working on the behavior of the person and according to this they have to develop this theory psychologist che ane emne aa theory je che develop kareli che it was further developed by the carl jung so is the alfred then after alfred uh, alfred alder then the karen harry and the eric forman so this theory is divided on the promise that the unconscious need of the biological is derived from this the theory they have to highlight the human mind structure on the three parts id ego and super ego aa je theory je che e જે છે એ સૌથી પહેલાં જે છે પ્રોનાઉન્સ કરી છે ફ્રોડિયને અને ધેન આફ્ટર આલ્ફેડ આલ્ડર કાર્ડ હેરી એરિક ફોર્મર અને કાર્લ જર્ગ એમને જે છે આ થિયરી જે છે એને ડેવલપ કરી છે સો ધીસ થિયરી હેવ ટુ ડિવાઇડ થ્રી ટાઈપ્સ ઓફ માઇન્ડ કે હ્યુમન માઇન્ડને ત્રણ પાર્ટમાં ડિવાઇડ કરવામાં આવ્યા છે ફર્સ્ટ વન આઈડી આઈડી ઇઝ રિફર ટુ ધ સાયક્લિક એનર્જી એન્ડ ધ બેઝિક ઇન્સ્ટિક વિચ અ પર્સન ઓલવેઝ સ્ટ્રીવ ફોર ધ સ્પેસિફાઈડ ધેમ કે એક એનર્જી જે છે જે આપણને માઇન્ડમાંથી થ્રુ મળે છે સો એ કન્સિડર એઝ અ આઈડી ઓકે સેકન્ડ વન ઇઝ અ ઇગો ઇગો ઇઝ અ કોન્શિયસ એન્ડ અ લોજિકલ આર્ટ ઓફ ધ હ્યુમન પર્સનાલિટી ઇગો ઓફ ધ પર્સન ઇઝ અ ફંક્શન એઝ અ ઇન્ટરનલ મોનિટર એન્ડ ધ બેલેન્સ ધ ઇમ્પલ્સિવ ડિમાન્ડ એન્ડ ધ સોશિયો કલ્ચર કલ્સ કન્સ્ટ્રેન ઓકે ઇગો જે છે એ શું છે કે વન ટાઈપ ઓફ પર્સનલ ફંક્શન જે છે કોઈ પણ પર્સનનું એ હેવ ટુ ડિવાઇડ ઓકે એ ડિવાઇડ કરે છે એ ડિવાઇડ કરે છે કે ડિમાન્ડ અને સોશિયો કલ્ચર કન્સ્ટ્રેન્ટ જે છે કોઈ સોસાયટીના કલ્ચર જે છે તો એને અકોર્ડિંગ ટુ જે છે એ એને એક્જેસ્ટ કરે છે થર્ડ વન દેર આર ધ સુપર ઇગો super ego is represent the noble thoughts ideas feelings which a person is strives to uh, acquire from his parents friends religion and the team member ke super ego che ene kya thi mole che ena family member ma thi ena friends ma thi ena religion ma thi ena culture ma thi ene mole che so this about the freudian theory then after then after the jungian theory is to be a Uh, consider as this theory was the developed by the Carl Jung so it's called the Jungian theory and this Jungian theory would be happen to be the their colleagues of the Sigmund Freud according to this Jung is to be personality is to be a build following pairs and the dimension so this Jungian theory is the Jungian theory is consider as the sensing and instinctuing thinking and feeling they have to divide the group તો એમણે પેર બનાવી છે અને પેર અકોર્ડિંગ ટુ છે લોકોનું પર્સનલ બિહેવિયર હોય છે પર્સનાલિટી ડેવલપ થાય છે સો ફર્સ્ટ વન દેર આર ધ સેન્સિંગ એન્ડ થિંકિંગ બિહેવિયર તો એમાં પર્સન કેવી રીતે વિચારતા હોય છે એની પર્સનાલિટી કેવી હોય છે સો રેશનલ ઇન ધ બે ડિસિઝન મેકિંગ કે સેન્સિંગ અને થિંકિંગ જે પર્સનાલિટી હશે તો એ જે પર્સન હશે એનું જે થિંકિંગ જે હશે એ રેશનલ હશે ડિસિઝન મેકિંગ જે હશે એકદમ કરેક્ટ હશે સેકન્ડ વન that decision are objectively oriented rather than the subject ke e je pan decide karse to the point enu decision hase subjective decision hase nahi then after logical and the empirical view point ke emu je view point hase view of point uh, they have to be a logical and empirical ke they have to be a decide according to logical decision koi pan decision lese eni pehla enu logic ena mind ma clear hase then after risk avoided rather than the risk assume ke e loko evu vichare che ke risk assume kartva karta e je koi decision le che ke ema su risk risk che ane risk ne kevi rite taalvu barabar che e loko avoid karva mate sauthi vadhare work kare che ke assume karva karta short term tactical decisions rather than the long term uh, long term strategical decision barabar che ke koi short term decision leta nathi અહીંયા જે ઇન્સ્ટિટ્યુશન અને જે સેન્સિંગ અને થિંકિંગ જે પર્સન હશે તો એ લોંગ ટર્મ ડિસિઝન કરતાં એ લોકો જે છે એ મેઇન ફોકસ કરશે એ લોકો લોંગ ટર્મ ડિસિઝન પર શોર્ટ ટર્મ ડિસિઝન પર એ ઓછું ફોકસ કરશે દેન આફ્ટર સેકન્ડ વન ઇઝ અ સેન્સિંગ એન્ડ ફિલિંગ 
so empirical empirical view point they have to be a decide according to empirical they have to decide the all analysis things and then after they have to decide second one is a beliefs in the risk sharing rather than the avoiding or resuming they have to always a uh, share the risk okay e loko su karse avoid par nahi kare ane resume par assume par nahi karse resume par nahi karse koi risk je che factor ne e loko risk ne share kari dese ke je thi ochu risk thai ane vadare benefit mali shake showing a concern for the others while making the decision ke sensing and feeling type ni je personality je person pase hase to e bija loko sathe concern karse ane bija loko ne person bija person je che to ene pan ema koi decision che barabar che to e decision ma bija loko ne koi harm nahi thatu to enu pan e dhyan rakhse short term practical rather than a long term strategical decision ahiya je che e loko शॉर्ट टर्म डिशीजन पर वे प्रीफर कर सज पर्सनालिटी हे ये लॉन्ग टर्म पर प्रीफर वे करे देन द थर्ड वन इज अ इंट्यूशन एंड द थिंकिंग सो इंट्यूशन मीन्स वॉट समाइम वी से द गड फीलिंग ओके घना 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 सीईओ है टीम मेम्बर्स है कि टीम केप्टन है तो ये कोई गड फीलिंग हो जेना द्वारा ये कोईपण डिशीजन राइट लई शे ये गड फीलिंग के इंस्टिट्यूशन क्या थी आए थे फ्रॉम देर एक्सपीरियंस फ्रॉम देर वी केन्स एक्सपेरिमेंट्स राइट सो फर्स्ट वन देर आर द बॉर्डर आउटलूक अबाउट द वर्ल्ड अराउंड के लोगों जो आउटलूक हे जेपर डिशीजन ले ऑल अराउंड वर्ल्ड ने डिसाइड कर ले से वेट्स ऑप्शन इज मेंटली के लोग कोईपण डिशीजन से लेता पे जप्शन मेंटली डिस्क्राइब कर सनालिशि कर सैन आफ्टर रिस्क अज्यूमर विथ द स्पेक्युलेटिव डिशीजन स्पेक्युलेटिव डिशीजन जो है बराबर एम लोग रिस्क अज्यूम कर सी कोईपण डिशीजन ले से देन आफ्टर स्क्रीन वाइडर रेन्ज ऑफ द ऑप्शन इन द डिशीजन मेकिंग डिशीजन मेकिंग जयरे पर करे कोई डिशीजन ले तो बदाज अल्टरनेटिव रिस्क ये कंटीन्युअसली डिसाइड कर सचीज कोई डिशीजन लेन आफ्टर लॉन्ग टर्म स्ट्रेटेजिकल डिशीजन अँ जो पर्सनालिटी हे पर्सन ए लॉन्ग टर्म डिशीजन पर फोकस करे फोर्थ वन देर आर द इन्वाइटिंग एंड द फीलिंग सो द बोर्डर आउटलुक अबाउट द वर्ल्ड अराउंड एंड देर आर टू बी अ लेस प्राइस सेंसेटिव के अँ प्राइस सेंसेटिव ए ओछा हसे पीपल ओरिएंटेड शोइंग द कंसर्न फॉर द अदर आ अँ जो पीपल हे जेपर पर्सनालिटी ए लोग पीपल कंसर्न वे हे देन आफ्टर फॉलोज द सब्जेक्टिव ओरिएंटेड इन द डिशीजन मेकिंग रादर देन द ऑब्जेक्टिव कंसिडरेशन ए लोग ऑब्जेक्टिव टू द पॉइंट डिशीजन नहीं परंतु ऑब्जेक्टिवली डिशीजन जो है पहला लें देन आफ्टर इनडिफाइन टाइम होरिजोन इन द डिशीजन ए लोग कोई डिसाइड नहीं होत के के टाइम होरिजोन शॉर्ट टर्म मैं डिशीजन लेवा है कि लॉन्ग टर्म मैं ओके आई होप यू अंडरस्टेन्ड दीस थीयरी देन आफ्टर थर्ड वन इज अ नियो फ्रीडियन थीयरी दीस सीगमुंड फ्रॉड्स इन एन हिज कलिग्स हेज टू बी अ डिसेग्री विथ दीस आइडिया देट पर्सनालिटी इज अ प्री प्राइमरी सीच्युएशन सो अमोंग धेम वेर इज अ आल्फ्रेड आल्फ्रेड आल्डर हेरी स्टेक्स एंड द सुलेवान and the kan horinli and the alfred alder is advocated this human theory still to attain the rational rather than the institutional goal so there is overcoming this controlling feeling harry sex sulevan has to stress this people continuously attempt to develop their fruitful relation with the other and stills to reduce the mental tension so this karl harney also believe that people prefer to reduce the tension so they classi classified human group into the three category complement aggressive and the detach okay ke neo fruit theory je che e sena upar che ke सैम्यून फ्रूडे जो थीअरी आपी ए टोटली बेजिकली इंस्टिट्यूशन पर बेज थी जयरे एम कलिग जना टोटली डिसेग्री था जेना जे न्यू थीअरी डेवलप कर कार्ल हेनरी द्वारा एमने एवं कीधु कि कोई पर्सन जो है यू कोईपण पर्सन हो बेजिक थिंकिंग एवं हो रिड्यूस द टेन्शन राइट सो ये तर ग्रुप में डिवाइड कर कॉम्प्लिमेंट एग्रेसिव एंड द डिटेच सो कॉम्प्लिमेंट जो हे बराबर पर्सन ए लोग कोईपण सीच्युएशन जो है इन्हें कॉम्प्लिमेंट आप हमेशा रेडी हे एग्रेसिव पर्सन दे के नॉट थिंक एनीथिंग दे ओनली डूइंग द एग्रेसिवनेस नेचर थर्ड वन देर आर द डिटेच सो दे हेव टू बी अ टेक द डिशीजन अकोर्डिंगली टेक द सीच्युएशन एंड देन आफ्टर दे हेव टू बी एनालाइज एंड टेक द डिशीजन ओके 
then after last one is the threat theory okay threat means what there are the personal qualities is considered as the threat okay so the threat theory is believed that the personal personality is to be a judgeable for for the threat so the threat is defined as a threat is the distinguished enduring while of the which individual differs from the another so the personality is to be a judge from the pers presence of the certain threats ke koi person je che e bija person thi kevi rite alag che to ena mate threats je che barabar ek ek way provide kare che threats means the quality of your quality of person right so the list of various type of traits they have to be pronounced by the different psycho uh, logical list is and the uh, we can say denotomical manner like the reserve and the outgoing koi person je che reserve personality che koi ni outgoing personality che then submissive versus dominated ke koi person je che e koi person ni vaad ne je e कंसिडर करे फॉलो करे कोई पर्सन जवॉइड करे सो दीस आर ऑल्सो कंसिडर एज अ थ्रेट थीअरी दीस ऑल आर पॉइंट्स कंसिडर सो द वॉट आर द मेन अजम्पन ऑफ दिस थ्रेट थीअरी सो थ्रेट आर द कॉमन टू इंडिविजुअल बट दे वेरी एब्सोल्यूट अमाउंट इन द इंडिविजुअल थ्रेट जो है डिफरंट पर्सन ने डिफरंट होमन थ्रेट्स ए बदा इंडिविजुअल पर्सन ने हो कई अलग कोई क्वॉलिटी जी है ये कंसिडर करे थ्रेट्स केन बी मेजर फ्रॉम द बिहेवियरल इंडिकेट्स के कोई पर्सन न बिहेवियर है एना थी थ्रेट्स जे छे कंसिडर थाय थ्रेट्स आर स्टेबल एंड हैव टू बी अ यूनिवर्सल इम्पेक्ट के थ्रेट जे छे स्टेबल हो यूनिवर्सल इम्पेक्ट जवा है सो ऑर्गेनाइजेशनल बिहेवियर यूज के ऑर्गेनाइजेशन जे आ थ्रेट थीअरी क्या यूज करे फर्स्ट वन लोकस ऑफ कंट्रोल मीन्स फॉर द कंट्रोल ऑफ द बिहेवियर ऑफ देर एम्प्लॉइज वर्कर एना थ्रेट थीअरी यूज थे सैकेंड वन इज अथोराइटेजेशन सो ऑथोराइटेजेशन मीन्स वॉट ऑथोराइटेजिजम मीन्स के ऑथोरिटी कवर करने कोई पर्सन पर ऑथोराइज करने थी थ्रेट थीअरी यूज थे देन एक्सट्रोवर्ट एंड इंट्रोवर्ट के कोई पर्सन जो है एक्सट्रोवर्ट है कि इंट्रोवर्ट है एना थ्रेट थीअरी इम्पोर्टेंट है मेकेलिजियम मीन्स देर आर द बिहेवियर ऑफ द वी केन से सीम्पल बिहेवियर विथ द हायर वी केन से ऑनेस्ट बिहेवियर सो थैंक यू वेरी मच हियर अवर टॉपिक लाइक पर्सनालिटी इज कम्प्लीटेड एंड हियर योर यूनिट नंबर टू एंड इन दिस यूनिट नंबर टू देर आर द वेरियस टॉपिक्स आर कंसिडर सो फ्रॉम लास्ट थ्री विडियो लेक्चर वी हेर स्टार्टिंग यूनिट नंबर टू राइट सो दिस इज द this topic regarding the personality is considered in unit number 2 and after this there are the two uh, sorry three topics are remaining learning and misbehavior and the emotional labors after this your unit number 2 completed so if you find any query regarding the personality then contact me thank you so much